Good morning. Welcome back to Just a Fox and a Bear. It has been a while since my last video. And as you can see, it is a snowy day. My hair looked great when I left the house. Not so much anymore. Anyway, we're going to see what we can get into today and what we can show you from here in Albuquerque. Well, after a long day of work, the snow has stopped and we are at Sandia Resort and Casino. We're going to catch some dinner in the council room and then hopefully see the Lunar New Year celebration that's going to happen in about an hour and a half. Let me show you what it looks like because the snow has definitely melted. Here, let me flip the camera. Alrighty. This is a really pretty casino. It is right here on the very edge of Albuquerque. There's a hotel. Obviously, I said casino. And they have a few restaurants and bars. They no longer have the buffet, which is too bad because I did enjoy their buffet. And let's walk up this way and let me show you the beautiful mountains tonight. The mountains had a lot more snow on them, but when the sun comes out, the snow melts quick. All right, let's go inside and see what we can find for dinner. And this here is where they used to have their wonderful buffet, which has been closed since COVID, unfortunately. But this place, when it was open, was hopping. Let's take a look at some of the jewelry that's for sale. If I can get it with all the glare. Yeah, I picked a bad time to try to sh highlight what's in the showcase here because of the glare of the windows in front of me. But it is beautiful. Alrighty, I just asked about the celebration and he said it's going to be at various places all over the casino. And I believe... Looking at the design on this pot, I'm going to say this is done by Robert Tenorio from Santo Domingo. But I could be wrong. But he does excellent work. Alright, let's go over around the corner to the council room and get ourselves a dinner. Here we are. All right, so dinner's a bust because I don't understand. They've got a bunch of open tables, but obviously no one's getting seated. So we are going to, I don't know, maybe just get a coffee and wait for the Lunar New Year celebration, which I had planned on getting dinner, but since not, we're just going to sit and wait for about an hour because there's really no place else to eat here. Um unless you want to go to a bar. All right, I'm trying to decide what I want for a snack since I'm not gonna get dinner. Maybe we will go for one of those cupcakes. And I decided to get just a snack before I watch the ceremony tonight. I got it here at the Kiva Coffee. I just got, whoa, a cupcake and a hot tea. Now, I don't know if it's like this everywhere, but in Albuquerque, there seems to be a shortage of people who are wanting to work customer service type jobs. So a lot of restaurants you will go in and there will be all these tables open and they will tell you it's a 45 minute to an hour wait like they just did me tonight. That is normal now. It's a Saturday night and yet um, they still don't have the staffing to handle that. That's what made the buffet great because even if you're short-staffed on table help, you can still get a bunch of people seated and fed with the kitchen staff working. So anyway, um, like I said, I do miss that buffet, but we're gonna have our cupcake and hang out for a little bit 
and then wait for the celebration to start here and then head somewhere else to get dinner. It's time to try the cupcake. I hope it's not dry. I don't know about you, I hate dry cake. Now there are some types of cake that are really dense and kind of dry, but they are designed to go with tea. But if I'm eating a cupcake, I do not want a dry cake. So let's uh, see what this looks like here. And it was already kind of tough to cut into, and I'm gonna use my fingers quick. Uh, it doesn't feel too dry, but it feels kind of dense. Let's see what it tastes like. It's a little dry, but it's not bad. Good thing I got tea. So while I sit here and enjoy my cupcake, um, the one thing I have noticed because I travel alone a lot, there are quite a few restaurants and that don't really want to seat a single table, um, which is really unfair because having worked um, customer service and whatnot, I am very fair, if not over generous on tips, which I have a feeling a lot of people who dine alone are. But when I went up to the stand to see if I could get a table and I said just one, he, he kind of made this face like he was hesitant and then he's like, well, um, 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 well, you know, um, yeah, there's a wait. I said, okay, how long is the wait? Um, well, at least 45 minutes, if not longer, because, you know, I've got all these names on here waiting for tables. So in other words, you don't want me to have a table because it's just me. Yeah. Um, I've eaten at the council room before. I do enjoy going there. I wanted to get a hamburger tonight, but I am, like I said, going to opt for just dessert and the tea. And then I am going to head to get dinner somewhere else that I know I can get as a single person and enjoy the Lunar New Year celebration. So that said, that is my little rant tonight on this video. Um, just because you're dining alone doesn't mean you don't deserve to get a table and doesn't mean that you should have to be put to, I don't know, put to the back or made to feel bad because you happen to be deciding to go out to dinner by yourself. So I was very disappointed with how that was. Um, but like I said, my main reason for coming here tonight after work was for the Lunar New Year celebration. So I'm looking forward to that. Fingers crossed that's really a fun celebration. I guess it's going on throughout the casino. And um, we'll, like I said, we'll go have dinner elsewhere because if you don't want my money, I'm more than happy to give it to someone else. All right, the event is about to start here. And while I'm waiting, I thought I'd show you. This is where the little gift shop is here. This is a drop-off entrance door here, and I believe it's also valet parking. And right across the hall is registration for hotel check-in. And across the way where the elevators are is where you go to access the rooms for the hotel. There is a guard there, so you do have to show that you have a key to a room in order to get in. And then there is the restaurant that I <laughs> unfortunately was not able to catch dinner in. And funny, they never ever got full. There are still tons of open tables. So I don't understand what the problem is or was, but yes, I am a tad bitter about that mostly because I'm hungry. But like I had said before, this is a beautiful casino. 
And back there is the main floor of the casino. So waiting for this has taken a while. It is almost 7 o'clock. It started at 6.30 and I guess they go through the entire casino before they come to the rotunda. I was told that they started the rotunda and go through the casino. So hopefully they finish in the rotunda because that's where I'm at because I haven't seen any dancers yet. So I'm hearing some drums. So hopefully here they come. It's obviously not so this has been kind of a bust of a Saturday night I thought I was gonna have some fun and see the Lunar New Year dancing and um, I have now spent almost two hours at the casino and haven't had dinner and haven't seen the dances this kind of blows so it looks like I'm not the only one who thought it was gonna go through there's a crowd of people that were waiting back here and yeah, we all thought they were going to come through here and parade through. And obviously, because of the way they let the crowd fill in up there, they weren't able to come through this main area. So a lot of us who've been waiting since 6.15 didn't get to see it. So um, for next year, I will not be coming back, which is unfortunate because... This is something I've been looking forward to all week and all I've gotten to see is the back of people's heads and hear the drum. Oh well, you know, when you do these um, events and it's the first time you've ever done them, sometimes you don't know what to expect. Um, but like I said, um, this has been an absolute bust of an evening. No, no dinner and no show. But now I know what it's like, and next year um, I won't do it again. Uh, and I actually do not recommend it. Um, if there is another Lunar New Year type event, I would recommend doing that. Um, but this one, um, I do not recommend. Thank you for uh, tuning in. This is Just a Fox and a Bear. Please like, comment, and subscribe. And until next time, from Albuquerque at the um, Lunar New Year event, that uh, <laughs> I didn't even get to see. Have a good night.